raise your hand if you've ever been broken up with because you are considered boring. So to clarify, my kid's dad, who I've been with for 10 years, broke up with me on Tuesday because I am boring. I don't bar hop. I don't go to the clubs. I'm not into that kind of shit anymore. I'm 35. We have a six and a five year old. And honestly, the last thing I want to do is be hungover when I have my kids. I'm not above doing it every now and again, but his new favorite thing to do is go out every weekend and sometimes during the week and go on boys trips and none of that has ever bothered me if he goes out every now and again to hang out with his buddies that it doesn't bother me but it's become like a every weekend thing and so since I spoke up and said that I think he needs to slow down and spend more time with his family he broke up with me I'm cried out I've done enough of that um I don't see myself going back after this because like it's embarrassing as fuck and I feel humiliated. I feel sad for my kids. I'm tired. I'm mentally drained as fuck. It feels like it's abusive almost. And I, it's like by the time the summer ends, like he begs me back and says that he'll change and it never changes. So has anybody ever been through this? Because like, I don't know. This sucks. Breaking up with the mother of your children because you think she's boring and doesn't go out enough is absolutely insane. He has a much more greater responsibility to raise his children instead of going out and partying every weekend. Going out once in a while is fine and they can get somebody to look after their children. But ending a relationship over this is ridiculous. It gets worse in the following videos when we hear the opinions of other women about this situation. Let's watch. Don't let him see the kids. Sometimes men need to be taught a very hard lesson. And I'm sorry for singling you out this way, but if you're a parent and this is your thought process after watching my video where I stated that my husband broke up with me because he considered me boring because I don't like to party, and this is your conclusion after watching that, it's wild. And you need to reevaluate some shit because that's not normal. I am not being assaulted. My kids are safe with their father. There is no reason to keep the kids away from him because he likes to go out on the weekends. Like, that's terrifying if you actually think this way. I don't know. Is it just me or does this seem like extreme? I love the way how she calls out this toxic woman for suggesting she should stop the father from seeing his children. Ironically, many women out there have this same type of vengeful attitude. And not only does it hurt the father, it mostly hurts the children. Here's another one. His time should be limited and he shouldn't have the same access to his kids as before. It's about principle. Obviously don't alienate him, but there should be consequences for him. So the only consequence there should be in a situation where a man wants to divorce you, but is a good father, is losing access to having a wife. It should never, ever be losing access to his children. That should never even cross your fucking mind. Are you unwell? Then you go on to say how I'm not protecting my children because I'm allowing them to be around their father who doesn't want their family together anymore. And I know it's hard for your emotional brain to understand this, but there is a separation there. He doesn't want to be with me. But he loves his kids and he's super involved and he's going to have access to his kids. He can walk in right now, later, tonight, tomorrow, any time of the day and come get his kids if he wants to. Because what actually hurts children is women like you that think that, hey, somebody doesn't want to be with me, so now I'm going to withhold the kids from him because he destroyed our family. Imagine if men were saying this to women who decided to walk out on their marriage. Oh, you should lose fucking access to your kids for destroying your family. No, instead, y'all like to fucking clap at single mothers who fucking walk out on their marriages. Don't be double standard. It's gross. This is a really good woman right here who has her priorities and morals in the right place. She addresses the problem with her relationship and doesn't punish the children or the father because of it. I just love the way how she roasted these women. That's good shit.